Welcome to the VMware Cloud PKS demo. In this video, I will show you how easy it is to integrate a Kubernetes cluster deployed using VMware Cloud PKS with um, out-of-box um, deployment of FluentD and Elasticsearch. Before we get started with the um, actual demo, let's first review a few concepts. A Kubernetes cluster consists of uh, multiple nodes and uh, each node you have you know, pods running on them representing different microservices. And the uh, FluentD uh, leverages a special type of Kubernetes uh, control manager called daemon set. Uh, and a daemon set is basically there to ensure a copy of the FluentD pod is deployed on each worker node in the cluster. And uh, as nodes are added to the cluster, a FluentD pod are added to them automatically by the daemon set. Um, if a node is deleted from the cluster, uh, the daemon set will um, remove the FluentD pod as well. Now, uh, FluentD uh, deployed on each pod is responsible for forwarding of all logs from all pods running on the, the worker node uh, to what we call a FluentD aggregator. And the FluentD aggregator is typically co-located uh, on the same node as the Elasticsearch. And basically, uh, the way it works is the FluentD running on each node forward its logs to the FluentD aggregator. And the, the, the FluentD aggregator will write the logs to Elasticsearch. And finally, um, you have what is called a Kibana dashboard. Um, you, with the Kibana dashboard, you can view real-time data in Elasticsearch, and also you know, have the ability to build um, custom queries uh, specific to your application. Now let's get started with our demo. Um, this demo assumes that you already have a um, VMware Cloud PKS cluster already deployed, and um, and then we're going to use Helm. Uh, Helm is a super simple way of deploying um, application stacks. Um, and uh, the first step with Helm is you need to deploy a tiller, and that the way you do that is using Helm init. And once the tiller is deployed, uh, you would uh, make sure that the repo is updated. And uh, once the repo is updated, you basically just install uh, FluentD first, and then you install Elasticsearch, and finally install uh, Kibana. And uh, once we have all three uh, components um, deployed, uh, I'm going to show you how you can access your Kibana dashboard uh, directly from your local laptop and uh, and then also how you can set up some basic filters to um, manage the microservices you have deployed in your um, Cloud PKS deployment. Now let's get started. So I already have the tiller deployed so I'm going to skip the first step and I'm just going to run a Helm repo update and now I'm going to install FluentD and it's FluentD is installed. Now I'm going to install Elasticsearch. And now I'm going to install Kibana. Now we're going to enable the port forwarding so we can access the dashboard from my local desktop. We can just do some basic filtering of, um, I can pick my Kubernetes host, and then I can look at my specific to my container app or my namespaces. So that's all for the demo. Thanks uh, for watching the video.